Hello, today I want to show you how to create an access database and then connect that database to an Excel from scratch. Let's go ahead. First, right click, new, Microsoft Access Database, simple table, enter, enter. It opens, enable. All right. Now we are here. Create table. Type in Michael. Let's say uh, surname Tom. Age 24. 20. Let's say 20. Now, field. Double click. Type in first name, fill to surname, and fill three age. Click here, Ta uh, another name, let's say my name, Bupinder, my surname, Tube. 22 enter table is created now okay guys table is created just now save you can call it any table you want let's leave it as default table one then close back here right click new and excel extracting data from access it's actually not extracting we are connecting to it enter after putting a name go to the data tab go to get data you can get from different places but we want from a database from Microsoft Access database select that so go to the folder where you save the database double click on it it's connecting now so now you have to choose the table we just created one for simplicity let's double click on the table one you can close this keep getting external data these are the queries and connections it says two rows okay so table is added here and now the beauty of access and connecting to an excel is this i will show you so you go back to the table that maybe everybody in your organization would use so different people can access it from different spreadsheets so you go there and let's say we got a new person now let's call the new person a name let's say Susan Smith and she's 55 enter just close it and it's automatically saves that and now if I go back to the Excel and you go back to the design or you can go to the data and then you click here refresh or alt f5 and wait a minute and you can see Suzanne is added so if I delete these two I move away from there and then again go to the data and then click on refresh they come back as simple as that guys this is how you connect an access database to an Excel it's a connection so it's permanent I hope you enjoyed watching this video and if you learned please don't forget to watch my other videos and put the comments below if you have any questions I will do my best to answer them thanks for watching bye bye